Hey everyone, JSHD here and today I'm going to be showing you how to do the cinematic effect you're seeing on the screen right now. Now there's two different ways you can kind of use this. One fades out, which you saw firstly, and then this one where the soldiers don't fade out. So yeah, let's get started. I'm just going to delete all my uh, layers and start again. So I have my cinematic here. I'm just going to delete the audio track because I don't really need it. And I'm just going to right click, disable resample. Okay, so to get started, you just want to. Uh, I'm just need to speed up my cinematic because it's it was in slow motion. Okay, so first things first, you want to find where you want the first soldier to stand still at, and that's just about there on mine. So what I'm, what I'm going to do is go to the uh, previewing mode and change that to best full. Now I'm just going to click the floppy disk icon and click save snapshot to file. I'm just going to call this uh, one and uh, I'm going to save it as a PNG because that's usually slightly higher quality than a JPEG okay once you've done that uh, you need to insert a new video track and then within time uh, your snapshot should appear in your project media um, area so I'm just going to delete these ones I had from earlier I don't need them so here it is and what you need to do is make sure you drag it onto the same position where you took it from which was there for me and now what you want to do is uh, right Oh, sorry. What you want to do there is right click, then go to video event pan and crop, then go over to the mask, and just click this cursor button here, and then move and zoom in by scrolling um, to whereabouts it is. Then uh, choose the like button. Thanks. and then choose the and then choose the anchor button and start masking around your soldier now I'm just going to do this roughly obviously you want to take uh, some time and care over it in your own edits just so it comes out a lot cleaner Okay, so once you've done that, you'll be able to see that you have your first soldier standing still, like so. Now if you want to fade it, just shorten this and then choose a, a suitable length to fade it after, like so. And then obviously the next step is just to take another snapshot, which is probably going to be about there. Go to best of all, a safe snapshot to file, I'm just going to call this one too and then we're going to have to insert another video track and then just wait for the snapshot to appear uh, in your project media tab so mine's there and I'm just going to shorten this to about there, I'm just going to do the same method event pan and crop, mask uh, zoom in to where you need, want to mask it out and then just quickly mask around it once again I'm just going to do it really quickly because um, there's no need for me to take great care and detail I'm just showing you the method. So that is pretty bad, but it, it gets the job done, I suppose. Um, so yeah, just gonna fade it off again. So now if we play that through, so I mean best of all, it's laggy. Um, put it in preview half. Play that through. We've got the two soldiers. Now you just want to repeat this method for however many um, like clones you want to make and it's that simple obviously take care over the masking because the better you mask it the better it will come out um, just because it will be like a higher detail not sure how to explain it but that is it for this tutorial um, if you've been, found it helpful be sure to let me know by giving this video a thumbs up and uh, if you want if you've got any suggestions for tutorials then let me know in the comments below as always this has been Jess HD and I'll see you all in the next one